The generate fill in Photoshop is amazing, but here's an issue that no one's talking about and one way of solving it. When you zoom into an area created by the generator fill, you'll notice that there's a vast difference in resolution between your original photo and the generated pixels. That's because the generator fill only generates an image that's 1024 on the longest side and it stretches it over the image. You can see what 1024 looks like against this photo. This blue square is 1024 by 1024, so the generated content of this size gets stretched out over the entire image to create the fill which causes the pixelation. By the way, typing HD, 4K, 8K, or anything like that in the prompt will not work. So how do we solve this issue? Well, one way is just to do it piece by piece. Let me show you what I mean by that. If you go into image, canvas size, you can add 1024 pixels to either side of the image. And here's the trick that not a lot of people know. You can add equations to all Photoshop input boxes with numeric values, including the canvas size box. You can type plus 1024. But in this case, instead of doing 1024, I'll do 1014 because I want a 10 pixel overlap. You'll see what I mean in a moment. But the overlap helps avoid seams and it generates better results. Now click on this icon to add that extra space to the left of the image. You can also check the relative box and type 1014, but the relative checkbox is not on all input boxes and it cannot divide or multiply. Plus it's a useful trick to know. Let me know if it was new to you. Now you can press okay and you'll have that 1014 pixel wide space to the left of the image. Then you can go into the rectangular marquee tool under style, select fix size and make sure you make it 1024 by 1024. And when you click on the corner here, Photoshop will generate a 1024 by 1024 selection and if you notice, I have a 10 pixel overlap. That's why we made the expansion 1014 rather than 1024. Then click on generator fill, leave the prompt blank and click on generate. Then go back into the rectangular marquee tool and repeat that process until you complete the whole left side. These were the pixels generated over the entire image and these were the pixels generated piece by piece. Not perfect, but much, much better. And of course, repeat this process on the other side or the same side to make it wider. By the way, this is not really a bug. Adobe's testing things with the low resolution results. I would assume results will have higher resolution when it's out of beta. Also, keep in mind that generative fill works with actions. You can definitely create an action to expedite this process if you like. And if you learn something new, make sure you like and subscribe.